Today's Torah portion is super important. In it, God tells the Jewish people that he's establishing a covenant with them. Not only the men, the women, and the children who were born into the Jewish people, but also the converts who attach themselves to the children of Israel. Not only the people who are alive that day, but all the people that would be born to the Jewish people in the future, and also the converts who join themselves to the Jewish people in the future. And he also told the Jewish people that if there would ever come a person who would say, hey, you know what, let me go serve the gods of other people, then what's going to happen is that person's name will be deleted from history. The line of the Jewish people will not continue through him and this is something that we have seen over and over and over again only when the Jewish people hold tight to God's commandments and they keep his Torah does that Jewish line continue so many groups of Jewish people have just died out into the surrounding cultures because they did not hold true to the Torah of God the Essenes and the Sadducees all of the early Christian followers who were Jewish who had so many different generations so many different groups of people that were just lost to history where are the descendants of Paul where Where are the descendants of the original apostles? Where are their Jewish children? The one line of the Jewish people that was never lost to history was the Pharisees, was the Orthodox Jews, the Jews who did not budge in our traditions, the Jews who said we refuse to bow ourselves to any idol that comes our way. We refuse to serve a God that we have historically not known. We are duty bound as Jewish people to remain firm and to serve only the creator of the world who is not bound by time, by physicality, and who has never assumed human form. This is our security. Amis. So high.